Here comes the field for tonight's fifth race. 30,000 in the twin trifecta carryover. Field of 10. One Rock Rollin' Rumble, owned by Myron Brown and Dave Brumbaugh, driven by Del S. Miller. Two is Stewball, owned by the home stock farmer Charles Smith, Jr. Three is McParker, owned by Kelly McKenzie, driven by Jack Daling. Four, It's All Good, owned by Mary Kearns and John Welby. Ryan Holton will be aboard. Five is Zedat Sammies, owned by Richard Slaughter. Mike Wilder will be in the bike. Six, Delusion of Grandeur, owned by Jerry, Diane, and Jeff Chimini, and Robert Salzberger with Terry R. Thomas. Seven, Rafiti, owned by Jerry Zazel and Dave Hawk. Eight, Look Jim Bob, owned by Jackie Teagar, driver change Jim Daly. Number nine, Morgan T, owned by the Magic Touch Incorporated. Earl Ricks and Loretta Crown with Jody Essig. Number 10, Wakeshire Wendy, owned by Ayers Ratliff and Robert Carroll Jr. David Repine is in the sulky. Five minutes till post, 30,000 in the twin trial. Field is now in motion. And there they go. They're off in pacing. Rafiti on the far outside takes the lead. It's all good. Quickly between horses. Here comes Stewball to join them. Up on the outside, eat at Sammy's. They're down the back stretch. Rock Rowan Rumble gets away fifth out of the second tier. Wigshire Windy to sixth. Racing midway on the turn. Mac Parker seventh. Delusion of Grandeur is eighth. Ninth on the outside, Morgan T. And at the end, it's Look Jim Bob as they slug this one out by the opening quarter in 28 and 1. They're off that top turn and racing past the stands to the half mile pole. Here comes Stu Ball up on the outside to challenge Rafiti for the lead. Stu Ball and Rafiti are heads apart. Wakeshire Windy also moves to the far outside. It's all good, is in the fourth. Followed by Edat Sammy's in fifth, Rock Rowan Rumble sixth. Being carted up on the outside, Morgan T to seventh around the clubhouse turn. Look, Jim Bob is eighth. McParker is ninth along the rail. Delusion of Grandeur is tenth. They're at the half in 58, a realistic clip here in the fifth. They're down the back stretch. Bouncing right along, Stewball continues to lead the way. Wakeshire Windy is up on the outside. It's all good coming on between horses. Rafiti's going to come to the outside again. Morgan T moves up on the far outside. Nowhere to go for Edat Sammy's along the rail as they race by three quarters. Stewball continues to lead the way. Rafiti is up on the outside in a quick 127. Moving around the far turn. Half a length for Stewball. Rafiti between horses. Morgan T moves up on the outside with delusion of Grandor as the field straightens away. Stewball on top. Rafiti is in the center. Morgan T third. Delusion of Grandeur on the far outside, racing through the stretch. Stewball has got the lead. Stewball, Rafiti, here's Morgan T getting up second. Here comes to Stewball, a four-year-old bay horse by Albatross out of Pleasure Seeker, owned by Home Stock Farm of Millersburg. Trained by Richard Wagers, driven tonight by Charles Smith, Jr. Covering them out here in 157 and two in a lifetime best. Number two, Stewball, the winner of the fifth. The two nine exacta, $114.20, 114 20 Big payoff in the first half of the twin try, 419.50. Windows open on the six, scratch the five, sharp dress Sam. Mike McNabb driving eight, Sam at two. Post time in 15 minutes at 920.
Here's a rundown of the fifth. Rock, Row, and Rumble was fifth. Stewball, the winner. McParker, seventh. It's all good. Eighth. Edith Sammy's ninth. Delusion of Grandeur, fourth. Rafiti, second. Look, Jim Bob, sixth.